Types of pavements. 1. Flexible pavement. 2. Rigid pavement. Flexible pavement consists of a layering system of materials that distribute the wheel loads to the subgrade. The thickness of the individual layers must be such as to distribute the loads without permanent deformation of the materials, thereby presenting an uneven running surface. Rigid pavement consists essentially of a concrete slab resting on the thin granular base. The loads and the stress are distributed over a wide area of subgrade by the rigidity and strength of the pavement. The pavement may be reinforced or unreinforced depending on the designed traffic load. Now difference between flexible and rigid pavement. Empirical method based on load distribution characteristics of the components. Designed and analyzed by using the elastic theory. Granular materials with bitumen are used as the key materials. Made of cement concrete, either plain, reinforced, or pressed concrete. Low or negligible flexible strength. It has high flexural strength. The wheel load is transferred by grain to grain mechanism. Load is distributed over a wide area of subgrade soil due to rigidity or high elastic modulus. Elastic deformation acts as beam or cantilever. Local depression causes cracks. Transmits vertical and compressive stresses to the lower layers. Tensile stress and temperature increases. Constructed in the number of layers. Laid in slabs either plain, reinforced, or pressed concrete. No stress is produced. Stress is produced. Less deformation in the subgrade is not transferred to the upper layers. The friction force is high. The road can be used for traffic within 24 hours. The road cannot be used until 14 days of curing. Rolling of the surfacing is needed. Rolling of the surfacing is not needed. 